what's good you guys so today i'm doing trainings it is 10 o'clock in the morning and i just wanted to come on here really quick and um just talk to you guys and i'm super tired so i am oh shit drinking my tea because i need energy and then, throughout the day, I'm going to be drinking this. It has my collagen, my beauty booster, and then I have lemon in here as well. So, I want to say this is half a gallon, maybe. So, I'm going to be drinking that throughout the day. I'm also going to be showing you guys what I'm going to be having for, like, my break, my snack, my lunch. Um, things like that. Sorry, it's gloomy. I had the window open, but it's still gloomy. And, um, on my lunchtime, I get 30 minutes and I will be doing my workout, my 20 minute bike section session, because they don't have a 25 minute. They only have a 30 minute. That's not enough time for me to shower and everything like that. Cause I got a 30 minute, uh, lunch. So by the time I do my stretching and shower really quick, like I have to take like a five minute shower. Like, there's no excuse. Whenever you want to get your workout in, go ahead and do it. There should, shouldn't be no excuses. Um, and then tonight, I'll do, like, my weights, my squats, and any other type of exercise that I want. Then I'll take my time a little bit more, do my stretching. And then on the weekend, I'm going to start doing yoga. I found some, like, videos on YouTube. So I will be doing that, and then I'll be letting you guys know. Um, what I think about it, but this year, um, I want to get into yoga. I want to become more flexible and stretchy. And I also, last night, I started reading like positive books, meditation books, and things like that to help me because last night I wasn't feeling the greatest, like, you know, mentally. So I said, instead of me watching stupid YouTube videos like crime shows and cooking videos, let me start reading books and I think that that helped me a lot just reading and reading positivity and reading how we think that our life should be like you know what I mean they were talking about like gambling when you go gambling you take a risk and you think that you're gonna have the luxury of being rich right away and life doesn't work like that you have to put in the work to get what you want in life so things like that like they just motivated me today, inspired me. So I hope that you guys are doing good. And let's continue watching the video. All right, so I am on break right now. <clears throat> I am going to have yogurt, I think. So right now I'm just going to have some yogurt. This has 110 calories. And I don't really track um calories. Sorry for the heater being on. But... You know, I like to be keep in mind and being mindful of what I eat throughout the day, especially if I work out because, you know, I just would like to make sure that I don't overeat um, a lot of calories. And then I'm going to be using some oats and honey granola from Great Value. So we're going to use this and then we're going to use some pumpkin seeds. So this is the amount of pumpkin seeds that I'm going to be using. And then for granola, I don't really measure. I like to go a little bit ham on my granola. I would have added more, but the cup is pretty small. So this is going to be, I guess, my breakfast slash lunch. No, let me just call it breakfast. My breakfast. There goes Mar working out. Get it, Mar. Get it, Mar. How you feel? You okay? I'm like dying. Oh, my God. I'm so out of breath. I haven't worked out in over three weeks. Right? Yeah. <sighs> I'm getting this workout in on my lunch break. And then tonight, I'll do my weights. I can't talk anymore. I gotta go. I smell like onions. And... I don't smell it. Um, um, oh my god, I smell so bad. You see my me and my bonnet and then my eye mask on because... I did my exercise super early today. I took a shower and I was like, yo, I gotta lay down because 
My body's sore. We haven't worked out in three weeks. Uh, I'm exhausted. Are we starting out the vlog well? Because a bitch gotta get to the grind. Like, we got to get working. Don't mind the bed in the background. Yeah, I know my gym is in my room. There is no excuses. If you, no, really I, you can't really see the bed because we're covering it, but, but still. So, yeah, so um, what else I wanted to say? We're going to upload this vlog today, obviously, and we're going to do a mukbang tomorrow, a cooking recipe, a mukbang. That should be going up, um, I'm pretty sure, by Friday, hopefully. Anything else you want to say? Let them know, Z. Let them know you're doing the workout, man. I'm going to go shower really quick because... I only have a certain amount of time, and I gotta get something to eat because I'm starving. She's on her lunch break, oh. by the way. That's what it is. So yeah, I'm dead. Twenty minutes, and then tonight, I'll do my arm workout and stuff like that, which we're gonna include that in a separate video. So stay tuned for that. You guys, for my lunch, I'm gonna have one wasa cracker with some roasted chicken breast, some hummus, and then some Swiss cheese. Don't mind the counter; it's a lot of mess. I'm gonna show you how it looks when I fully prepare it. So this is what it looks like. I did two slices of turkey, two slices of cheese because I love cheese, and then a lot of hummus on the bottom. So I'm about to eat this right now because I'm starving. I'm eating me a slice of Swiss cheese and a string cheese just because I'm not like hungry. Mm. But now, now that she's eating something, I'm like, damn, I should have just had something too. So mm. I'm going to do this before dinner. And this wasa cracker, I think only has like under 60 calories, so you could actually eat two with tuna, okay. anything you want. Mm. And my water bottle. So quickly, I wanted to show you my order for Herbal Life because I ran out of a lot of things, and you guys know that this is what we use on a daily basis. So here I got. Um, you guys, I'm so pissed because if I would have known this package, we literally passed this package on the table. If I would have known that, I would have tried these right here these protein bars instead of eating that hummus cracker because this one is the citrus lemon and i never tried this flavor before i tried the peanut butter chocolate peanut butter and the almond one and they're pretty good but i want to try this citrus one so she, she talked me into getting it so i wanted to get it because sometimes like today earlier i wasn't hungry so yeah. i had the cheese um so. and these bars are so good because you don't get hungry eating these um, she also ended up getting her straightening shampoo because this shampoo is bomb um, It lathers very well and it's gentle on the hair. It has aloe. So it's super good for the hair and then she got um, A chocolate protein shake. Well, no, this is the meal replacement. They do have the uh, protein, protein and then mint chocolate chip this you guys with the peanut cookie uh, protein shake um oh my god it tastes just like a chocolate peanut butter shake and it's so freaking bomb so that's that's all you got right yeah that's all i got for now yeah so um, she's already stocked up on the stuff that she needed but guys this bar is so freaking good it tastes like a lemon bar to me it's fudgy it kind of reminds me of a key lime pie too like i don't know it's just like so good it's just fudgy and chewy and oh man it's so good this is probably my favorite one it's good I and like marlene it. doesn't marlene's very picky with what she likes even my dad loved it and i don't know how many calories, Let me check the calories hold on you guys it has 10 grams of protein because i'm starving again and then 140 calories so which is good so me and marlene shared a little bit of it uh it's so good i don't want to eat too much because we're gonna have dinner later in two hours and I just want something to hold me over till dinner time quick little grocery haul we ended up getting some spam I ended up going a little while ago cuz it's gonna snow a snor a snowstorm and I I don't have time to be shopping so I got squid I got some tortillas some rigatoni cuz we're gonna be doing a five cheese pasta um and then hold on we got everything in the sink because we washed everything so we letting it drain here i got some black peppercorns to add to my thing we got some coconut water because marlene's been uh yeah because lately oh my god wow <laughs> so loud uh-huh lately because you know i'm obsessed with soda um i be putting the coconut waters in the freezer and they be freezing and i like the chunks of coconut and that like um that like does something to my brain i feel like it like um, it helps better so 
Here we have Swiss cheese. I think it's the flavor and how cold it gets and the chunks of I, coconut pieces. Yeah, is good. and it makes me not want the soda because the coconut water like does something to me like where I get that, that sweet tooth fix. That's what I was trying to say. Yeah, so we got some ricotta for the five cheese pasta. We got some Ortega sauce because we're going to be making like a healthy Mexican lasagna. We got some cheese here. And then I just got to put this to the side so it could dry. We got some chicken breast here to make some healthy wraps. We have some, some six cheese ragu sauce. We got some chocolate chip cookies because Marlene wanted some. We bought some trail mix because we're going to be using this for something else. I have some cashews here. Some black Can beans. We? Oh my God. She's so annoying, you guys. I can't. People love when I say that. Peach mango salsa, because we're going to be using this for when we make, um, I don't know what we're making. And then French onion dip, because Marlene really likes this stuff. Here's this, more. Hold this. I'm going to slam it out the floor. <laughs> and then we have some cheese. We got some Cracker Barrel cheese, because we're going to be using this for... Queso. Yeah, and then we have some Chipotle cheddar, because we're going to be using that to make our pizza. I mean... Pizza, the five the, cheese yeah, pasta. the pasta, and then Marlene wanted some. Oh my God, these are melting, um, not melting, but getting super soft. Uh, chocolate chip cookie dough. Um, Man, cookies. Sean, I think it's that subscriber that said, "Oh, do a mukbang with cookies." Now I want the cookies. So. Yeah, so we got these. I don't think we're not making these today. We're just gonna put them in the fridge. Um, um, let me show you what we got. Hold on. Then I got some ground uh, turkey. I got three of these. I got boneless, skinless chicken, and I got some pork chops. And I also got what else do we get? Um, some like steaks. And then I got some hummus right here. The roasted pine nuts hummus. And you guys, I ended up getting these. I don't really eat sweets like that anymore, just because I have trained my body to stay away from anything sweets. But because I love anything pumpkin, I had to get these. Um, I'm just gonna save them in the fridge for like maybe next week or something like that. And maybe I'll make them because we're not gonna eat these today. But look how good these freaking look. So I was working today and I told my sister yesterday that I was not gonna buy anything because the fucking heater that yeah um i told that i wasn't gonna buy anything because i really don't need to buy anything and i'm just trying to save as much money as i can um so i ended up going today and of course i was putting some stuff out and i ended up going to the do not dollar section i went to the christmas section and i've been eyeing these um i found this um led tree topper and it's just a gold reindeer. And I wanted to get it, you guys, because it was only $1. And with my discount, I get it for cheaper, of course. So I ended up getting that one. This is the one that I was really eyeing. So I had to get this one because this is the one that I wanted to get super bad. Let me see if I could get it out for you guys. It's this one right here. And this one was a dollar as well. And this one has lights around it, so it lights up. And this one was a dollar as well. So I ended up getting these because when I get a big tree, I want to get like a, I don't know, maybe an eight, nine inch tree. If that's how big they make them. So I got those. Then I ended up finding this. It's just a little spoon holder. So when you're cooking, your stove doesn't get dirty. And I used to have one of these when I used to live in New York. So I ended up seeing this one. Although it says Merry Christmas, I'm still gonna use it. And then it comes with that holder. So I'm gonna just put more spoons because the one that I have is overly crowded. Um, I ended up getting this for a dollar as well. So I might've just paid like 80 cents because I got a discount. This is my stuff. I just have to put my name on it. Then I ended up finding these uh, stockings. And I got these because you guys, you cannot believe how much this was. Where is the price? It's somewhere here. A dollar for four. Okay, for four. So I got one for my sister, one for my brother, one for me, and one for my dad. So since they were four, I'm like four for a dollar twenty-five cents, you guys. You cannot beat that. So I had to get that. Then what else did I get? I ended up getting these cookies for my dog. 
these were a dollar as well so i got him these because he loves his treats so i got him these i'm about to give him one right now then i ended up finding these shorts for marlene because you already know if i find something for her since she's a small now i ended up getting her these biker shorts these were 349 for the gym and when we go walking in the summertime so i got her those and then I ended up getting her these biker shorts too. These were $4.49 and they look like this. I'm always buying for everybody. I never look for myself. These have the pockets on the side so you could put your phone and stuff like that. So I got her these on a small. I got my brother these um, face and sponge body set so that he could wash his face with the smaller one this one and then the bigger one for his body so i got him this this was 199 and then i ended up finding this belt i was not gonna get it but then i was like let me just get it because it was only 199 and i just thought it was so cute because it had this um butterfly on it and it's like a like a cream color so i'm like it fits me so i'm impressed that it fits me because you guys medium slash large belts never have fit me a day in my fucking life so that's amazing so it was super cute so i got this as well and i think yeah that's pretty much it and all in total i only spent 16 dollars on everything so guys we're going to five and below let's see what we find in here hopefully we don't find too much you guys peep those mats those fitness flooring mats i literally spent in dicks like 40 something dollars and in five and below i think those were three dollars 395 or like three dollars can you believe that like that's why it's always good to look at different stores and just look at you know websites and stuff because literally i could have bought three of those for under ten dollars and i spent 40 something at dicks which is still not bad because the the mat that we have is really good but still, man, like, I like to save me my coins. I don't know about y'all, but I like to save me some coins. Mm -hmm. Listen, if you're trying to start working out at home and you on a budget and you don't want to go to the gym and you want to buy your little gear, they have clothes here, water bottles, Pilates stuff, yoga mats, everything you could think of, go to Five Below. No, they don't sponsor me, but still, they got good stuff. Check them out. In the next clip, we're going to show you um, all the stuff that we got because we needed to get more stuff, especially to work out on our arms and things like that. But they even have every type of dumbbell you could think of, 5 pounds, 10 pounds, 1 pound. Like, it's just incredible to me that you could get stuff for under $20 at 5 and below. Like, they have an amazing selection just to start off, especially if you're like a busy mom or you don't know how to do a lot of workouts you can always pop you know take a little time and pop a youtube video on or something like that and just work at your own beat you get what i'm saying so check them out if you're looking to start this new year right um and get your fitness on man get it going okay you guys so quickly i'm gonna show you guys everything we bought at five and below so we ended up getting this 10 pound ball Darlene was showing me how to use it. They had the five pound one, but when I lifted it, I didn't feel like it was gonna do too much for me. I and think I want it. It shows you here like on the side, and then you could sit down on the floor and go side to side with it. So it's a medicine ball. We got that. And this was five dollars, by yeah. the way. Yeah, and this is perfect. This is a good size look yeah. like that. So this is awesome. We also ended up getting this ab roller core straight training for five dollars. We ended up getting this mat because I'm going to start doing yoga and stuff like that and stretching because, listen, I, I need to do something because... We have another mat, but we needed another one. Yeah, so, so we, we got, got one. we already got the green one, so we wanted to get this one, $5 as well. And then we ended up getting these sandals right here because, um, you know, we always need new sandals. So we ended up getting two of these for $5. And then also I ended up getting this water bottle. Not that I need more water bottles, but I'm like obsessed with water bottles now. So she conned me into getting it. I yeah. Mean, getting it for her. She's yeah. like, I like it. I'm like, just get it. I'll buy you one. Five dollars because I don't know. I feel like when you have a nice water bottle, 
it makes you drink yeah. more water. So um, I'm using my Herbal Life one now, but I think eventually I'm going to get rid of it because after a while you need to change them and things yeah. like that. So I'm just going to take this one as well for work and just to have when I'm drinking water at home since I'm going to be working from home. I'm making fettuccine Alfredo tonight. So here's my sauce thickened up. Here's some Parmesan cheese. I put basil, oregano, hot pepper flakes, raw garlic, and salt, salt and, pepper. and pepper. And then I did a little bit of butter and flour to thicken it up because I want it really thick. And then for noodles, we are using fresh pasta. So this is going to make a hell of a difference because we use usually use like Rizzoni or Barilla, right? Mm -hmm. So we just bought um, fresh pasta. Let me show you the brand that I got. So this is the brand that I got, Egg Pasta. Um, this was like $4. So I ended up getting this one. We were going to do shrimp alfredo, but I forgot the shrimp. So we never had it plain before. We're not even going to make bread or anything. Um, and we're just going to eat it plain. So I can't wait to try it. For our pasta, we're just going to put a lot of black pepper on top. And then I'm just going to add this little mix of six cheese blend Italian here because I already put enough cheese on the sauce yeah spoon so we're just mixing everything and then up. now i'm gonna add the sauce oh mama the star it's gonna be delicious it's so thick and creamy Ooh, look how good does that look real creamy and thick oh my goodness does this look amazing and i'm gonna put more parmesan on mine on top when i serve it oh wow look at that oh and gene does this look amazing we're about to plate up you guys and we're about to eat because i'm hungry well, this is dinner tonight you guys they said it is so freaking good i put extra black pepper on mine we didn't put no more cheese because i didn't need it so let's get to eating guys this movie is really good it's called seat filler um it's on hulu so good so i just got another gift from Powder Room D and it just says congrats on the new job. So proud of you and all your amazing accomplishments. Here's a little something to make you date extra sweet. Hope you like this mouse pad for your computer new job. Oh my God, thank you. I love it because I needed one. Because I'm going to have, I already have my mouse and my keyboard. Actually, I got to set up everything tomorrow because I start on Tuesday. But oh my God, I love this mouse mouse this keypad is right is it a keypad or something hold on i'm so excited mouse pad i love it i can't thank you so freaking much so i want to show you all the clothes we're getting rid of it's just a mess of bathing suits and dresses and jeans and sweatpants and t-shirts everything you could think of like we've gotten rid of so much shit 2x 3x you know like 1x 1x it makes me kind of sad in a way because i'm like oh my god so much memories with these clothes but i'm i'm glad because you get rid of old stuff and i think it's just the hoarder in me like i feel like getting rid of like old stuff like i even got rid of shirts that i used to wear in 2000 in the early 2000s can you believe that i had those shirts when i used to go clubbing back you way back those shirts for 20 years yeah those are were my favorite shirts when i tell you my favorite shirts and it's just like oh my god i'm gonna pass it down to somebody else a bigger girl that can rock them because they're cute shirts or whatever and show a lot of cleavage and stuff and i'm like oh my god like i just hate being a hoarder like this is nothing like we have more clothes, but they a lot of them have tags. So we're going to donate them to the woman's shelter because they can't take used clothes. They need new clothes. So the next round of clothes that we're going to get rid of is everything in tags. And we have a lot of clothes 
with tags. But here we are, all finished. We had to put them in garbage bags because we don't have like any big shopping bags. So there's a whole bunch of bathing suits and stuff. So yeah, cute stuff gonna be donated to the Salvation. This movie right here is oh, called this. Second Act with J Lo and Leah Remedy, right? And Vanessa, and Vanessa Hudgens. It's such a good movie. I didn't think it was gonna be good, but if you're looking for a new movie to watch, this is on, I Hulu. think Hulu. Okay. Check it out. It's super good. It's okay. okay, guys. So really quick, I want to show you this little gift Norma sent us, our subscriber. Darlene should probably be getting here. I just got mine today. Look how cute it is, you guys. Mm -hmm. She knows us so well. I cannot wait to wear this. Like, I freaking love it. Thank and you And so it's much. crazy because Powder Room D sent us earrings, like, similar to this. And now we have this nice-ass chain. Like, thank you guys so much. You guys know us so well. And this is the necklace. And she got this from Amazon. So, thank you so much. This is gorgeous. Some more stuff from Amazon. We ended up getting this black rice brand oil peppermint and this is just a hair growth oil and we got this from amazon because we saw good reviews so we're always looking for stuff for our hair and it's good for the face and the body as well so we got this and then i ended up getting these um jewelry for my lip in different sizes as you can see there's smaller ones excuse me i got the hiccups bigger ones and then they have the different size of the balls and i think this was 8.99 or 9.99 so i'm gonna try to put one of these on and see if it will work for my um what's it called the piercing ashley. ashley piercing because this one is way too big and i really need to change it so i'm gonna try this one with a flat back and see if that works so you guys i'm gonna go out for a little bit with my co-workers um i'm gonna be wearing these sneakers and i'm gonna show you my outfit right now so here's my outfit this is the selena top that we got from i want to say rue 21 these pants are from lauren conrad from kohl's my sneakers, I have no idea where I got these. And then this jean jacket is from Mandy. And then I'm going to pair it up with some gray little hoops that Powder Room D gave me. And this lipstick is, I have no idea, Stila. I want to say this is Beso. Yeah. So, in my outfit. Cute. So we decided to go to like a, I want to say it's like a sports bar kind of um slash restaurant is like a restaurant but in the back they have like a huge bar where you can watch all the sports and like boxing and stuff like that so we went there because the place that we were going to go to initially was closed but we had such a good time you guys like i don't know how i wasn't wasted like i drank so much i had those sakis i had strawberry coconut mojito i had this tea shot i had seltzer and vodka i had tequila i had coronas i had every drink that you could think of thrown my way and i was perfectly fine and i wasn't even hung over um i didn't get no food because you know um when i drink i don't like to eat if that makes any sense um uh, my co-worker did tell me to take some of this pretzel which it was really good uh, but i only took a little bit because as you could see all that salt um i can't be eating a lot of stuff with salt like that so yeah it was fun though we had a good time and hopefully one day in the near future we do it again because with everything going on you know how it's a little crazy out there so i just came from work and i was doing markdowns today um, because of the holiday season, everything has been marked down. So I want to show you really quick everything that I got. I don't know how much my order was, but for everything, um, I spent $70. So let's start off with this. So the first thing that I got, get this out. The first thing that I got Ooh. was this, oh my God, dude. was this little pot right here for $6.99. 
And I just decided to get this because, you know, sometimes me and my sister don't want to cook a lot. And we don't be eating that much like we used to. So make me maybe make the beans in here. Mm -hmm. Make beans in here. And take, this. yeah, get this one. Then I also got this one. A small, is it the same size? They might be the same size. Yeah, they're both the same I mean, size. It's okay. I, I got these. two because six ninety nine on clearance. I think they were like twelve ninety nine or nine ninety nine. But I'm gonna use these. Uh, maybe I'll take one to Florida to oh, make yeah. rice and chicken yeah. or soup because my dad likes to make soup. The next thing I ended up getting were these uh, microwave and cooktops since we have a flat range in the new crib. So I'm gonna take these with me. These were one ninety nine. So I'm gonna take these to Florida. Um, then I ended up finding these. These are for electronics and phones. So I got this one for $1.99 for our phones and our TV. Then I ended up finding the Rejuva Care. So I ended up getting two. These were $7.99. I actually found them just walking around. Then I ended up finding these disaffecting wipes. These were $1.99 as well. I ended up finding this old, um, apple spice. Apple pie spice for 99 cents. So I got it just to make oatmeal or to make like different dishes um, to put in my smoothie, my Herbal Life pumpkin spice smoothie. I can add some of that or to make uh, sweet potatoes or apple chips. We're going to be making different meals. Um, then this is the next. Hold on. Rejuvacare right here. I ended up. Um, Finding this, if I could get it out the damn thing, because Marlene is not helping at all. I found this Milani eye pencil thing for 49 cents, and I got this for a giveaway, to do a giveaway, so that's that. I finally, you guys, finally found the purse. I got this purse, and my wallet actually fits. Nice. This was on clearance, too, so this was $9.99, so I ended up getting this, because I needed that. Um, I ended up getting these towels. These were for Halloween, but I saw them for 49 cents and I'm like, you know what? I can use this for my kitchen because I always run through these like water. Um, I ended up getting these as well. I found these seven piece kitchen microfiber, uh, set of towels for 49 cents, 99 cents. So I'm like, yeah, I'm going to get these because these are good. I go through these like crazy. Then I ended up finding, let me put the receipt over there. Marlene has been wanting this for the new crib because we don't have a space to put the mops and the brooms and stuff. So I ended up finding this for $2.49. So of course I had to pick it up and it looks like this. So the color matches perfect with the kitchen. So I got That's that. Perfect. I ended up finding these Hocus, Hocus Pocus spatulas for 49 cents. One of them is broken. But because they are the Hocus Pocus characters, I needed to get them for 49 cents. It's missing one, but that's okay. How much cheaper were they going to give it to me? I only paid like maybe like 30 cents for it. Then I found these um, lavender wipes. So I found these for 49 cents and I picked them up because I'm like, you know what? I could use this for the kitchen or for the bathroom or something like that. So I got that. Open this for me, please. I ended up finding, you guys, these spices. This is basil, I think, rosemary, and oregano for 99 cents, you guys. So I had to pick two of them up. Um, so I picked them up. And then I ended up finding some makeup. I found a uh, lipstick queen. I found this for $1.99 in orange, if you could see that. I also found this one. As well, an orange, $1.99. I ended up finding the Sephora. It's just like an eyebrow tint thing. I found this Lipstick Queen, $3.49, a duo in black and in a different color. And then I found this lip gloss for $2.99. This brand is pretty pricey, so I bought this maybe for a giveaway if we don't want it. And then I got my other seasonings right here. I ended up finding these mitts. You guys remember I bought these the other day. I found them for 49 cents, so I had to pick them up. I ended up finding more wipes. These wipes were antibacterial, 49 cents, so we'll use these for the bathroom. I ended up finding these, 
and you just put these uh, sticks inside like the bathroom and the sink. So I got this for $2.99 and it just cleans the pipes and makes sure it doesn't stink. And then I ended up getting this little mat thing since I'm going to be working from home and I'm going to have to make like a own, my own desk. I ended up getting this for $0.49 because I had to get a laptop and all that crap. Um, next thing I got was this... Hold on, if I could get it out. This tablecloth. And you guys, $0.49. Cents. I'm like, you know what? My table's not that big, but once I move and stuff like that, I'm going to buy a bigger table. So I had to pick that up. Then I also ended up finding... Everything's like falling over. I also ended up finding these napkins, you guys. And I'm like, you know what? Let me get these. So whenever I want to change my table setting up, I got these for 49 cents as well. So I ended up picking both of them up. And then lastly but not least, let me take this out and then I'll show you um, individually. But not least, I ended up finding this pumpkin spice spread for 40, 99 cents. I ended up finding this joyful jar thing for $1.99. I think I'm gonna start putting my granola in here and things like that. I ended up finding this pumpkin spice whipped honey, 49 cents. I ended up finding this pumpkin butter for 49 cents. I got some pumpkin spice for 49 cents. And then I ended up getting pumpkin spice for 99 cents so check out your ross you guys they have a lot of clearance every section makeup everything i gotta wash these makeup house care bathroom check all the sections out because there's clearance and everywhere you just gotta take your time and look okay so i hope you guys enjoy this little haul that i just showed you so for our snack tonight this is what we're having toasted coconut cashews when i tell you you guys these are so amazing. I had some last night. They're so good. They're the perfect treat, the perfect dessert. Super good if you want sweets or something to like create, like satisfy that sweet tooth. If you like any nuts and you love cashews, I'm telling you, pick these up. You're not going to regret them. So, hey, you guys, so this is dinner tonight. This is a whole wheat bread like a roll yeah with tuna onions and some lettuce and i'm not gonna show myself because i just finished training i want to eat i'm hungry and then um if you guys want to see more videos like this give it a thumbs up and like the video share the video thank you guys so much for watching and see we'll see you next time, time. bye, bye guys, guys.